Hey there, Ashley here from Vend. In this video, we will cover connecting Vend to Shopify. Before we begin, we recommend watching our quick video on the Vend Shopify integration pre-check as it will list the product requirements for a successful setup. To begin the integration setup, the account owner will need to log in to both Vend and Shopify. Once logged into Vend, click on Setup, and then Add-ons. This will bring you to Vend's add-on page where you'll see Shopify listed. Click Connect to Vend. This will prompt you to add in your My Shopify URL and authorize your Shopify account with Vend. If you're unsure of what your Shopify URL is, this can be found in the URL bar when you're logged into your Shopify account. For example, copy the URL at the top of the page and paste into the text box. From here, click Save. Next, you'll need to confirm that the Vend app can be listed in Shopify. Click Install Unlisted App to authenticate and save. Once saved, you'll be directed to log into Vend. And then you'll be asked how you'd like to manage your products. During the initial setup, there are three ways to manage your products depending on how your product catalog is currently set up in Vend and Shopify. First, there is the option to manage products in your own accord. This would be the best option if you only wanted to publish a select number of products from Vend to Shopify. The second option is to import all from Shopify. This would be the best used option if the majority of your products are in Shopify and you're looking to import them into Vend. Additionally, importing all products from Shopify can be used if you want to link matching products in Vend and Shopify on the basis of matching SKU and handle. The third option is to publish all to Shopify. This would be the best option if the majority of your products are in Vend and you're wanting to push them across to Shopify. For the sake of this tutorial, let's anticipate we have the majority of our products in Vend and we will opt to click Publish All to Shopify. Now that we've actioned the bulk published to Shopify, we can expect that products will begin to appear on Shopify's product page. Keep in mind that depending on the number of products in your Vend account, this can take some time to complete. While waiting on products to publish to Shopify, we do not advise clicking Publish All again or beginning to publish individual products, as this can slow the process significantly. While products are loading, we can complete the rest of the integration setup in Vend. You will see that after clicking Publish All to Shopify, the page directs you to finalizing the integration setup. At the top of the page, you will notice you have the same product management options that were suggested on the previous setup page. If you previously selected to manage products manually and now want to publish all to Shopify, you'll have the option to click Publish All Products. Alternatively, if you want to import products to Vend, you'll have the option to click Import Products. The toolbar also offers additional options to import Shopify orders. Later on in this video, we will share the steps to ensure orders sync automatically to Vend. To complete the settings page, first you'll need to assign a register for Shopify sales to sync through to. Then you'll need to assign a payment type for all Shopify sales. It's worth noting that this assigned payment type is not tied to the Shopify payment gateway. Instead, think of it as a way to reconcile payments in Vend for reporting purposes. Next up, you'll need to select whether product vendor on Shopify will display as the Vend brand or supplier. This is a personal preference and entirely up to you. Moving on to syncing inventory. At the stage, you'll have the option to select which Vend outlet to sync inventory levels with Shopify. Keep in mind the outlet that is selected by default is the outlet that your e-commerce register is assigned to. We've now reached the last step in the setup process. Here you'll see that Ben asks if you want to opt in for automatic order updates. Selecting the checkbox will mean that orders will sync automatically to Vend. Ben recommends that this is enabled to ensure orders sync automatically 
and overselling does not occur. If you choose to manage orders manually, it is recommended to monitor your Shopify sales closely and sync them to vend as frequently as possible. Now that we've selected your preferences, click Save. This confirms that the integration is set up and your settings are saved. If you ever need to navigate back to this page, you can do so by clicking on Setup, Add-ons, and selecting the pencil icon to the right of the Shopify badge. Thank you for tuning in to our video on Vend and Shopify Setup, and be sure to keep an eye for more videos coming your way.